For SAB Miller, the Food Water Energy Nexus is all about the interconnections between those different systems. And this is particularly important for us as a major brewer, one of the world's largest brewers, because br brewing beer um, in many ways captures all of those different dimensions of the Nexus. So we start with water, naturally. Water's at the heart of the brewing process and clean, safe supplies of water, absolutely fundamental for us. And we need to agree that with the communities that we, we live and work with. Um, but at the same time, uh, the more water we can save, the more energy we save. Because of course, brewing involves heating up that water to high temperatures and then cooling it down to cold drinking temperature. So every drop of water we save is also energy and carbon saved there. And of course, we also, as a company, uh, need to make beer from agricultural products. So at the same time as thinking about conserving water and energy, we're thinking as well about how to make sure that our work with smallholder farmers, for example, uh, is enabling them to thrive, while at the same time providing us with secure supplies of good raw materials. A few years ago in Bogota, Colombia, um, our local company there, the local company of SAB Miller is Bavaria there in Colombia, um, was uh, facing very high or increasing uh, prices from the water utility there in Bogota. And when we discussed this with them, we found that the prices were rising because of uh, increased costs of processing the water, which was caused by extra silt in the river. And we found that that was caused by expansion in cattle ranching, in some cases quite inefficient cattle ranching, further upstream that was cutting down the vegetation. So we got together with the Nature Conservancy and with the local water authority and agreed a small fund to help support those cattle farmers uh, to develop more efficient farming, perhaps uh, involving buying better cattle. And they were able to produce uh, more milk uh, with uh, fewer cattle and at the same time cut down less vegetation. So that in turn solved the problem for the river. And in turn that led to cost savings for us as a company as well as for the local municipality. And at the same time that starts to help resolve those potential tensions between that form of food production and the water that we and other local communities needed. There are huge synergies between the motivations of a business and the needs of local communities and the planet in relation to the food, water, energy nexus. So for a company like SAB Miller that's so dependent on local raw material supplies, agricultural supplies and local fresh healthy water supplies, um, resolving the potential tensions inherent in the nexus uh, is driven by a profit motive, but it's also very helpful for us and for the communities that we uh, that are our neighbours, um, because that uh, profit that is uh, driven by making more energy and water savings also results in the saving, for example, of water, and therefore more water being available for those other users, local farmers, local communities, other businesses that also rely on that shared resource.